Hi everyone, my name is Bindu. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, we are going to talk about spark lines in Power BI. If you don't know what spark lines are and how to create them in Power BI, please proceed watching this video. By the end of this video, you will get to know what a spark line is and how to create spark line in Power BI. Let's get started. Spark lines are tiny charts that can be added to table or matrix in Power BI reports. If the business wants to look at the data as well as look at the trend at the same time, then you can add these spark lines to your Power BI report. This will help the business look at the numbers and also the trend at the same time. So when you add the spark line to a table or a matrix, a column gets added to the table or the matrix and the column, it represents the trend. You will understand it better when you actually see it, how we do it in Power BI. So without any delay, let's get into my laptop and see how to create this spark line in Power BI. If you look at my screen here, uh, this is a sample sales report that I got from Microsoft site. You can download it from there too. So I want to see the trend of the category by year. Okay, so that's my requirement. So because I want to see the sales, the number that I have to pick is sale amount. So that I'll get it in sales fact. This is the sale amount. So I want to come, I want to see the trend for this sale amount. But because I want to see the spark line, because, because I want to include the spark line, I will have to use either a table or a matrix. So I'll be selecting a matrix here. And then I want to see the trend of the sales based on category, product category. So I go to pack, uh, product data set and click on category here. And now I'm see, seeing the sale for each, cat, each product category. And now if I want to add spark line to this to see the trend, to see the trend of this category by year, then you go to the values here to the uh, sale amount for which you want to see the trend you go there and you right click on it and say add a spark line okay so uh, you get this pop up here and now uh, because this y axis the sale amount is already a summation this is grayed out otherwise you can select you want to see the average minimum maximum values uh, of this sale amount okay and on the x axis i want to see i want uh, the trend to be by year. I want to see the trend by year. So um, I go to date hierarchy and select year and then I say create the spark line. Say create and a spark line is created. Just making it big. I'm increasing the font just to make it clear. Okay. Now I just increase the font of uh, all of them. And now you can see the trend uh, and based on this spark line you can you can easily tell that uh, the sale is growing the sale amount is growing for for these categories right and uh, you can also format these spark lines to format it what you can do is go to uh, go to this tab again and click on this click on the spark line and you can format go to format tab and you will have uh, format option for sparkle so you click on this and here you can select the highest and lowest points okay you can see the highest and lowest points and if you want to uh, point out each and every point of your of your chart you can also do that but mostly it's not needed everybody wants to see highest uh, where where it is highest and where it's lowest so that you can do and you can change the chart type to either a line chart or column chart you can make this a column chart as well you can do this also the line chart looks uh, much better when compared to column chart yeah this is how you create a spark line and you format a spark line so this is how you create spark line in power bi if you find this video helpful, please hit the like button. Haven't subscribed to my channel yet? Please do subscribe. See you in the next video with an interesting topic. Thank you.